So let's talk about some of the most important expected questions for your net examination now the very first one is india's development of the first braille laptop and this has been named as dot book so dot book is the name being developed by iit delhi very very important and this has come up in two series you have 20p and 40q one is the perkin series uh, and the next one is the QWERTY keyboard. So both the options have been available uh, and there are two variants of the dot book which is very very important. The next is in most of the uh, higher institutes you have artificial learning. Uh, artificial intelligence is one of the courses which focuses on problem solving, uh, planning and basically speech recognition technique which is very very important and some of the most important higher institutes working with this is IITs. Among the IITs you have Kharagpur, Madras, Silchar, Bhopal and Kanchipuram. So those are the most important IITs working with artificial intelligence as of now. Now these are the following 10 organizations which have been given the license to spy. Now this is a very very important development, a direct question can be part of it. So you need to know the 10 institutions that are there. What is NEVA? It's the National E-Vidhan application. Now all legislatures have been brought under one single platform bringing in much more reliability, trans transparency and accountability into the system and this is known as the National E-Vidhan application as we already said. The idea is one nation and one application. The next is PESA. Now this is the port portal for affordable credit and interest subvention. Uh, this has come up as an electronic uh, uh, platform which is centralized and mainly for the processing of interest on the bank loan. So all the interest going on to the bank loan is processed through this mainly under the Pandit Deen Dayal Antodaya Yojana. So that's the key idea. So what is PESA? The acronym for that is again important. The next is Epix Technology. This is Application Programming Interface Exchange. So again, a very, very important uh, banking technology which has been launched by Fintech at the Fintech Festival in Singapore. And this aims to connect all the financial institutions across the globe and bring up a banking solution for more than 2 million people. So it's a very, very important part of uh, the development. What is Epix? A direct question could be there. So it's an application programming uh, interface exchange which is the acronym for EPICS. The next is Pegasus recently in news now this is an spyware uh, developed by Israeli cyber arms which is the NSO group. So Israel cyber arm is the key aspect here and NSO group. Now this enables the jailbreak on the device and steals the passwords, the phone location and all the important uh, information from the other apps mainly through Gmail, WhatsApp, Telegram and Skype. Recently through the video calling of WhatsApp was the uh, key uh, area where this spyware was spreading. The next is some of the India's important development. So you have Pragati which is proactive governance and timely implementation. A very very important aspect to bring in much more uh, quicker uh, response to the grievance redresses that are there. Bringing in much more uh, transparency and uh, through the latest technology by digital data. It could be in the form of video conferencing, it could be in the form of geospatial technology. All these help you to develop quick responses to the data. OpenForge, again an initiative of Government of India. Now this platform is a kind of collaborative platform for various e-governance purpose and open source softwares can be used. Reuse of the uh, e-governance related source code could be done through open ports. The next is India Stack. Now this is an API which allows the government and the startups to use the digital infrastructure to solve the difficult problems for uh, presenceless layers, paperless, cashless services and consent layer. So those are the four aspects under which India Stack actually works very very important. So it's all the set of APIs that are working towards uh, government and startups. Darknet recently in news when you have any 
stolen information from the uh, atm cards or the debit cards credit cards it goes to the dark net so the dark net is a kind of a uh, portion of the internet which is not open to the public and it is a kind of closed platform where you have hidden networks that are superimposed on the internet and therefore uh, if the information goes into the dark net it's it's a kind of uh, important for the privacy matters the next is quantum supremacy very very important topic this year we have already covered a detailed video on this topic the next is neuralink now neuralink is a innovation by elon musk now this talks about the next generation computing which would be free from computers and mouse so a kind of continuous area of computer development we could say which works on neuralink platform uh, so those are some of the very important developments that we have seen in the computing section we'll be bringing up many important sections before your upcoming examinations so stay tuned have a wonderful day ahead